I came out in September and I wrote a similar op-ed September 23rd in the Detroit Free Press that I thought, after many, many months of not supporting an inquiry, that I thought it was time to come to have an inquiry. I wrote that in September along with six of my national security colleagues. Um, all of us had either a military or an intelligence community background. And after many, many years, um, I felt that the events around the Ukraine circumstance was fundamentally different. And let me explain to you why. Um, some of my colleagues came out in support of um, an impeachment, frankly, when they were sworn in, January 3rd. That was one of the first things that some people did. A whole other group of folks um, came out uh, around the time of the Mueller report and the Mueller testimony. And I did not think that, you know, the events of that, or the actions of that time were worth of, worthy of an impeachment inquiry. And I didn't because I thought we needed to let the election of 2020 decide what was going to happen in our country. That changed, that changed for me on the very basic facts that the President of the United States came out and his lawyer came out and said very specifically that they had reached out to a foreign power and asked him for information on a political rival. Rudy Giuliani said it openly on television. The president responded accordingly um, when asked by a reporter.